With each subsystem installation, the crew moves the muscle car a small step toward completion and a big day at the drag strip. For Alan, the small steps add up to an expensive restoration. Little bills become big bills very quickly. Little pieces over a long period of time add up. So we have spent an astronomical amount of money on this car. Six figures. My wife doesn't uh, know. Uh, I'm into it for six figures. I'm over the $100,000 mark for a car that started as a barn find. So it hurts. But I'm making it as authentic as we can. And the team working on it is doing everything possible to make it correct in every way. I guess we've done as much as we can do. Ready to go. See what happens. It's time to take the Camaro back to its roots. Today, Alan's out to validate the Z28's high performance credentials. Here, where the street racers went legit. At raceways across America, like ATCO in New Jersey, hot rodders morphed into drag racers. Instead of police lights in the rear view mirror, drivers focused on the heart stopping starter light called the Christmas tree. Stomping on the gas suddenly handed the driver hundreds of horses to control. And not everyone could. The drags test the driver with the machine. Slow though. Wow. Miami. This restored machine's ready now. <laughs> Looks great, guys. It is phenomenal. Whew. Back in its day, we know this car raced. That's what these were meant for. These were meant to race hard. We're going to see if we can take it down the track and break some records. Allen's a trained racing driver. He knows that there are enough variables during any race to turn a promising run into a disaster. You want to tell me anything before I go out here? Yeah, right before you get ready to go. Hold on. I want to prove that the car performs as we build it. So am I worried about taking it down the quarter mile? Definitely. Yeah, I mean, you have rubber on the track, you have wind, and you have concrete walls. You know, three things that I don't want to see next to my car. This test run is a double-edged sword for Allen. Go too fast, he could damage the car. Go too slow, and he'll lose the right to claim his Z28 is a track-tested, genuine muscle car come auction time. We're pulling up to a line, waiting for that light, and just, you're from nothing to everything you have within your power to get it down the track as fast as you can. That's blood pumping, heart racing action. It's 12 or 14 seconds of hold on white knuckle. It's exciting. Pretty sweet.